Hello everybody, welcome back to Let Me Marvel. So, Spider-Man No Way Home technically had the Sinister Six. While also technically not having the Sinister Six, still, it technically did. But using this logic, I have orchestrated the Sinister Six of 2002's Spider-Man film. Yes, the first actual live-action Spider-Man film that's actually comic book accurate since there was a 1977 one, but I'm blabbergasting at this point. So, the first villain of this Sinister Six is obviously the Green Goblin, because he's the Green Goblin. Like, he's the main villain of the movie. I don't even have to t say much about his character. He's just, you know, you should know plenty about him. After that is Dr. Strom. If you, for those of you who don't know, Dr. Strom is actually a Marvel villain in the comics. He basically was just the a villain that Norman Osborn kind of cheated off and everything in the comics, and he's actually an actual Spider-Man villain. After that is Flash Thompson. He's Agent Venom in the comics, and, and Venom's sort of a Spider-Man villain, but he also kind of was Peter's bully, so having him as, like, a Sinister Six villain isn't too far-fetched, really. After that is Bruce Campbell's cameo character. In Spider-Man 4, he actually, in the canceled Spider-Man 4 film, he actually was going to play Mysterio. Rather, if it's actually him playing a different character, or... He, he was always Mysterio, because I feel like he's, he was always Mysterio, so that's why I'm putting him on this list. After that is the carjacker that, well, was originally killed Uncle Ben. I'm just going to say he killed Uncle Ben, because I don't really say Sam and kills Uncle Ben, just because. After that is J. Jonah Jameson, because he literally just hates Spider-Man. That's, that's actually it. There's really nothing more to it. He just hates Spider-Man. That's actually all. You know, after that has to be all, actually. So that's all. That's all of this Sinister Six. So, yeah. So let me know down in the comments if you want me to do, like, orchestrating the Spider-Man... Orchestrating the Sinister Six and Spider-Man 2. Because I think that would be a cool idea. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Bye.